22 of Adventures in Welding. I'm Paul. Thanks for joining me. And today we're going to be fulfilling a viewer request. Um, a while back I did a video on spray transfer MIG and I had a request to show the differences between short circuit and spray transfer. So I've got some 3 8 inch plate here. I've doubled it up. We're going to tack it up in the open root position and I'm going to put in the root with short circuit and then we'll fill it up with spray transfer and show you the whole thing from soup to nuts. We'll be using the Eastwood MIG 250 and let me get everything started. And we'll three eighths inch steel so we're going to come over here. We got half inch, that's about three eighths. We got 035 wire well, it says not to do it with 035, but that's what we got. So, for quarter inch, it says 26 volts, 350 inches a minute. For 3 eighths on 45 wire, 27 volts, 350 a minute. We'll try it at 26, and if we have to go up to 27, that's what we'll do. But your Eastwood MiG-250 has that handy chart there. And we'll be running some ER70S6 filler wire. 035. So we'll get the front of our machine set up for 26 volts, 350 inches a minute. On all the right, we are all set up with our eighth inch gap. Let's get it tacked up. Right. There's our root pass laid in there all nice and neat. We're set up for the spray transfer. We're at about 29 volts. We'll bump that just a little bit to 30 and about 440 inches a minute. One of the things you need to keep a close eye on is your stick out. You want to keep at least a three quarter inch stick out. Any less and the wire will burn back and melt itself to the contact. All right, there is our first fill pass with the spray transfer. That's about all we'll need. Next, we'll put on the cover pass. All right, let's put in our cover. Alright folks, that'll show you what that Eastwood MiG-250 can do. For under a thousand dollars, you've got quite a bit of power. Let's take a look at our weld. Looks pretty good. Except for the end where my glasses fell off. 
spray transfer, short circuit, the Eastwood MiG-250 can do it all. Well, that's it for this episode of Adventures in Welding. Thanks for joining me. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. We're up to almost 300 subscribers. I need to get to 500, so tell your friends, share it out, help me get to 500, and we'll have a giveaway. Something nice from Amazon, something welding related. Until I see you again, keep your hood down.